you won't believe what's happening. During sex, who did he say burns up more calories? He does or you do? <laughs> I do. Yeah. I mean, yeah, you're right. I, <laughs> I was just picturing the image. Okay. You won't believe what they're saying. For how long did she say it takes you to fall asleep after doing the wild thing, as we say in the TV business? Five minutes, half hour, for 30 seconds. Under 30 seconds. <laughs> you won't want to be left out of this bold new fun zone where none have gone before. Which would she rather join? A country club, a health club, or the Mile High Club? I'll say a country club. I said the Mile High Club. <laughs> Welcome to the love lanes of life, where bold couples strike out for love and money. Does she tickle your taste buds, tickle your funny bone, or tickle your fancy? Tickle my fancy. Yes! yes <laughs> Here's the new show where the more personal details you know about your partner, the more you bowl. On national TV, we have to talk about this? And the more you bowl, the better your chance to win. Each day's leading couple gets a chance to knock down three of these prize-packing, too big for their britches, celebrity pinheads. The pinheads, ah! The pinheads, look at them. The Mondo Vigo Mania. Take home this new convertible if you're able to knock down your three celebrity picks. Each pinhead has a special prize and a special pin placement. It's so easy and so much fun. We now ask, are you ready to play Pindemonium? And here's the guy who's proved he's an MTV gamesman extraordinaire. Please welcome the man who couldn't bowl a perfect game in his own dreams, Ken Over. Hi, ho. Welcome to Pandemonium, the show that combines the skill of managing your love life and the dexterity of bowling. And speaking of dexterity, I would be remiss if I introduce my sidekicks, the Alley Cats. Well, shall we? Bill and Jordan, hop up here. Bill and Jordan. Oh, right, Jordan, nice to meet you. Bill, how are you now? No, let me get this straight. Your best man, your wife, and now yeah, you. Yeah, well, my best, um, my best friend up in high school was dating her um, in college, and he brought so, her over to meet me, and they broke up, and I'm kind of moved right in there and married her. <laughs> so, so in, in, a, in, in, in a shortened version, your best man has slept with your wife. Yeah. Okay, as you know, in bowling. You normally get two balls per frame, but here, to throw that second ball, you've got to earn it by answering questions about you guys. Now, now nothing is off limits, nothing is too personal. Whichever team ends up with the most points at the end of the game wins 500 bucks and a chance to go up against the pinhead. The more our young lovers know about each other, the sooner they'll get a shot at those pinheads for today's prize package and the grand prize convertible. Here are the quick rules. Each pin is one point. Each couple can roll one ball and then earn a chance to roll another just for matching answers to an intimate question about each other. With Pindemonium, the more you know, the more you bowl, the more you can win. So let's get to our game. It starts with round number one. Welcome back. All right, hey, I, I thought it was going right in the plastic thing. What's that called? Gutter? The gutter. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so let's see if we can get you up there. What did she say she would least tolerate in bed? Smoking, pets, or a third party? Least tolerate. <laughs> I'll say pets. Yep. Pets, very good. <laughs> All right, grab a ball, Phil. Hey, wait a minute. That one kind of blew by me, so it's okay if some, like, if the, the cable guy just shows up in the store. So. Well, you have to ask her. Okay, so Tammy, uh, if no I get comment. a... Okay, Phil, good luck. You got seven pins to work with. never been anything like this before. Love, sex, marriage, and it all happens at the bowling alley of life. For well, Darlene and Jeff, come and see here. Where else have you ever seen couples having so much fun? Here we go. No. Oh. <laughs> He's drawn. Yes, wow. yes, yes, yes. All right, drop six. Okay, Jeff, if you can match an answer to a question we asked Darlene earlier this very day. You can earn the right to get up there and try to finish off the spare. Okay, your life together is a soap opera. What would she name it? Where the grass is greener or the wild and the kinky? <laughs> Be honest. She just bought edible underwear. <laughs> uh... 
the Wild and the Kinky. Wild and the Kinky is right. Very good. Okay. Grab a ball, Jeff. There you go. Jeff, get in. Get the spear. You got four pins up there, buddy. Nice stance. <laughs> Couple bowls a total of three frames, then moves on to a catch-up round number two, where the special pins and right answers are worth much more. It's a chance for each couple to play catch-up and earn a shot at those prize-packing pinheads. So each pin could actually now be worth up to five points if you get them right. By the way, you only get one ball. You guys are in second place, and now you are down by 12. You need two questions. Stay in the game, of course. Anything over that, and the game is yours. We'll start off with you, Jordan. If he gets a bonus, will he save it or squander it? He squanders it. One right. On which side of the bed does she sleep, the left or right? The left. Right, two right. Where would he absolutely dread finding you? In a jewelry store, in a jealous rage, or in Playboy magazine? Well, he wouldn't marry in the jewelry store. It's got to be a jealous rage. <laughs> that's right. That's what he said. All right. In your relationship, is she the kisser or the kissy? The kisser. Yes, four right. Sound sound like Ed McMahon. Did he say you would do more damage parking his car or shopping with a gold card? Hmm. I think. What's, what's first one parking the car? It's got to be parking. Five yeah. right. Very good. You got five right. Who's gonna bowl? You need three pins for the win. Three for the win. I'm actually nervous, and I just met you guys. That's it. That's it. You got a whole slam and down. The couple with the most points at the end of the catch-up round will take a shot at the pinheads for the grand prize. Let's review their earlier pinhead picks. If they knock down the material girl, they'll win this brass bed. Knock down Arsenio, and they're off on a big adventure. Knock down Pete Rose, and they'll jet off for a Las Vegas vacation. Okay, let me see where the pin placements, because essentially you are creating your own shot. You said Arsenio Hall, right? Yeah. Arsenio holds down pin position number two. Okay. Nice smile, Arsenio. Floss much? Okay. You said Pete Rose? Yeah. Pete Rose, number three. Probably a number Pete bet a few times right. in his career. <laughs> he holds down number three, and they got a nice little grouping there. And you also said? Madonna. Madonna. I don't even know if I want to touch her without rubber gloves on, to be honest with you. <laughs> <laughs> number five, position number five. Look at that. Woo! What a great yeah. shot. You got one ball, who's gonna ball? I will. Jo Jordan, whoa, yeah. Jordan just took the reins. Okay, go ahead, Jordan, good right. luck, good luck, good luck. Let's go. Cross those fingers, yeah. though. There she goes. There she goes. Pandemonium is the outrageous new game where brave couples strike out for love and laughter. Every day is something new. Pandemonium. It's so simple and so much fun. Pandemonium is also the perfect opportunity to put this new franchise to extra work in your own market. By your station support, national contestant searches, and local advertiser tie-ins, Pandemonium can be the big new hit in your neighborhood lanes. Over 180 million Americans bowl every year. And it's a sure shot that local Pindemonium night would be an immediate success in your hometown. We'll see you at the Love Lanes of Life with a game that says excitement and big league success. This is John Leader saying we'll be looking for you next time for Pindemonium. Pindemonium is a Brad Lockman production in association with MCA TV.